I'm on a sidewalk. I can do what I want. All right, so you don't mind if I call the cops? You do what you got to do, brother. Um, we're just going to ask that, uh, are you willing to give us your ID? Oh, uh, no, I can't do that. I don't even carry it on me when I'm walking. Welcome back. You are here today with your boy, Anthony X. And today we're back in Hollister, California, the Tri-County area, conducting a First Amendment audit at the Amazon Fulfillment Center. Let's see if they honor and respect my rights to take picture and video in public and work on my story in peace. Make sure to pound that like button. Make sure to follow or subscribe. Show your support by sharing these videos and leave a comment. Let me know your thoughts, pass or fail. You be the judge. Last but not least, no bootlicking. Amazon Fulfillment Center, Hollister, California. Let's do this, guys. All right, guys, we are over in Hollister, California, San Benito County. And if you guys don't remember, probably a year or so ago, I did an audit here at Salad Farms. They did not like me recording, guys. Um, however, they were in, at the time, they were in construction of this new Amazon Fulfillment Center. Um, just to give you a little history, it was just opened up last year, bringing many jobs to the local residents. From what I remember reading, it's on a 25,000 foot, uh, sorry, 25 uh, plus acre lot. It has just shy of a 130,000 square foot building. At the high, highest point, it's about 44 feet tall. Has 710, if I remember correctly, uh, parking spaces for those Amazon vans. About 10 spaces or 15 for the trucks, like this size right here. And 200 and something, I can't remember the exact number, uh, parking spaces for staff and visitors. It's a pretty big facility, guys. It's not as big as some of the ones in Southern California or more up north but it's a pretty good size, you know, just for the Tri-County area. Anyways, as you can see, it's quite busy. We're gonna get some B-roll footage. Um, it's pretty windy. Hope you guys can hear me okay. Let's see if they honor and respect my rights. All right, as you can see, technically it's a business park. However, I believe the Amazon Fulfillment Center <laughs> occupies this whole area. There's no sign saying no trespassing or employees only. You know, nothing of that nature, so I'm pretty sure we could walk on there. However, keep in mind, if we do decide to go on the property and they want us to exit or get off the property, I will have to go back to the sidewalk. But um, I'm thinking about going in. What do you think, guys? And as mentioned, for those of you that don't remember, I did an audit right there across the street um, over by that little guard station at Salad Farms a while back. I'll leave a link in the description if you want to check it out. It was about a year ago. So I think I'm going to walk up here for a little bit. Um, no one's been saying anything, haven't been getting any dirty looks or anything. I'm going to go walk around, see how far I can go back before someone says something. Like I said, this is technically private property, I believe. There is a sign in the front that says it's a business park, but there's no other businesses or establishments on here. So I'm pretty sure Amazon has the full rights. Um, there's no signs, like I said, though, saying no trespassing, or employees only, delivery trucks only, nothing of that nature. Um, so yeah, let's go check it out. Let's walk around. There's not much really happening here in the office. I think I'm going to go uh, more focused towards the back uh, delivery area or pickup area and see how far I can get before someone says something. Like I said, if they ask me to leave, I will leave peacefully. Keep in mind, when I say I will leave peacefully, that doesn't mean I'm going to stop my audit or stop exercising my rights. It just means I'll leave the property and go back to the sidewalk. Let's continue. All right, guys, as you can see, we're in the back receiving area. Let's uh, continue. Let's walk around and see what we can see. I'm sure this will get some of their attentions, guys. All right, guys, let's work our way down towards the end of the receiving area. I did see some activity near the end. 
Um, we got a van right here with uh, one of the drivers, just looks like filling out some paperwork. And I really want to reiterate, I'm not here to bother or harass any of the staff here. I'm just here to peacefully exercise my rights, get some B-roll footage, finish my story, and be on my way. All right, looks like we got employee of the month. I'm not sure if that's just for the warehouse or the drivers or everyone in general. But it looks like we got right over here, we got January, February, we got March, April, and we'll see who's May, I guess, next month. They got masks for everyone who needs them. That's great. I honestly uh, feel kind of a little nervous being back here. I ain't gonna lie, guys. It's an amazing, huge facility. Look at it, it's all empty. They must have already been delivering. Got their microphone there, or blowhorn, whatever you call it. I'm sure it's got a different name. I'm sure I'm gonna get someone telling me. And like I said, no one said I can't be back here. Hope I don't get jumped, guys. I'm gonna turn on my body cam just to be safe. You never know. And like I said, I'm just doing a little tour here. Not here to bother anyone. It's an amazing facility, it's just huge. And this is one of the smaller ones, guys. Driver engagement. How's it going, you guys? It's amazing. So look at all that. How's it going, brother? Oh, I'm just doing a tour of the facility. It's pretty amazing. Who, who are you doing a tour for? Oh, for myself. How's it going? What's up, man? I can't have you all record inside the studio. Okay, I won't record anymore in there then. See so your guys' establishment. I'll respect your rules. How is that, that? That doesn't open up over there. That's a dead end, huh? All right, my man. How do you like working here? It's good, man. Is there, uh, what's the reason you're recording again? Oh, I'm just working on a story. Other than that, I really can't disclose anything, but I come in peace, my man. Yeah, I understand, but like, like I said, we can't have you just recording. Right? Oh yeah, I'm not gonna go inside and record well, in. Like it's still the facility right here. Oh, is that like your policy, or is that just, are you just saying, like, I didn't see any signs, that's why I'm asking. I didn't see any signs. You need a badge? Oh, you need a vest? You don't have any of that. I, so you got, you wanna let, part, let, loan me a vest? I mean, for what? You're, I'm a big guy, if you got like a 3X or something, I'll wear a vest. Are you working? Yeah, I'm working right now. For well, Amazon. Oh, I can't disclose any information. It's con that would jeopardize the investigation of what I'm working on. So you do work for Amazon? I can't disclose yes or no. I can't say yay or nay. I just got to say I'm working on a story, an investigation. It's open right now. And in the front, there was no sign saying like restricted or employees only or do not enter. That's the only reason I'm back here. Yeah, but it's kind of suspicious, you know. Yeah. Well, yeah, that's, that's what, you know, you, you, you have a right to come and ask yeah, I'm me. A, I'm the station manager right now. That's what I'm Okay. Because I, have, I haven't got emailed about this or anything. Gotcha. Let me just get your name badge there. No, you don't need all that email. I already got it. Appreciate it. But anyways, like I said, I'm okay. not Got you on body cam. You want me to leave? Yeah. Told about anything of this. Okay. Um, as far as I know. Well, yeah, we didn't tell you. No one told you because it would jeopardize the integrity of what I'm working on. We just want to make sure everyone's working safe, you know, following policies, you know, that nothing nefarious is happening. Every, you know, everything's done by the book. And your guys' cameras are running, right? 24 7, I would imagine. It shouldn't be turned off at all for any reason. But if you want me to leave, I'll leave. I mean, I'm going to have to put that in my report, though. That's fine. That's fine. All right. So get your name one more time there. All right. Have a good day, brother. All right, guys, so you heard that. He's uh, interfering with my investigation, so we're going to document that. Let's see what he's doing on the computer there. Oh, no, I got to keep it on or I, I get in trouble then. But I'm, I'm taking off, though. All right, guys, let's get a couple shots here from the public sidewalk of the back of the facility. Before we get into it, though, let me do a quick shout out for my daughter's handmade natural soap company, Sea Heaton. Go check out our website, www.seaheaton.com, for the best handmade natural soap in town. 
My personal favorite, cedar wood for men. Yeah, baby, make sure to use promo code AX1 for 10% off any $25 purchase or more. She's not only a phenomenal soap maker, she's a big supporter of the first auditing community. So show a little love, show a little support, go check out her website, and tell her Anthony X sent you. Let me get out of his way there. Well, do what you got to do, brother. I'm on a sidewalk. I'm on a sidewalk, my man. I'm on a sidewalk. I can do what I want. You do what you got to do, brother. I mean, I don't know. I wouldn't bother you if I saw you taking a picture somewhere on, on a public sidewalk. I mean, hey, bro, let's be honest. When I went inside there, there was no signs, and you told me to leave. I left peacefully. Is that not true? Yeah, but now you're harassing my driver. I'm not harassing I was, anyone. I got told by four drivers already that you're just sitting there recording. Recording is not harassing, brother. They just go in and go out. You got a camera on the building. Do you think they got my permission to record me out here? No, I'm on the sidewalk, brother. San Benito Sheriff or the Hollister PD, though, they're gonna, they can't do anything. I guarantee it. I bet you 20 bucks. Double or nothing, my man. So you can see they got cameras up there. They got cameras up there. And I guarantee it, they're not getting my permission to record. Why? Because they don't need it. Yeah, peacefully. Why? Just what Google Earth can see on this on the ground. I just want to know why, man. I mean, I told you before. I'm just working on a story. It's confidential or something. Yeah, it's confidential at the moment. I haven't published what I'm working on, so it would jeopardize it would jeopardize what I'm working on if I let you know right now. And especially that you called the police on me now when I didn't do anything bad to you. No, I, and I did leave peacefully. You can, you can ask, but the thing is, what you got to understand, and I'm just saying this nice, I can respectfully decline your request. It's not, you know, you're not my boss. I don't work for you. You're a supervisor of this facility, but not of me. No, if I get a job here, you have every right to say, hey, our policy on while you're working, you can't record, and I'll respect it. I'm just record, getting B-roll footage, brother, when they go in and out. I can't see their faces with the sun and the glare and everything. But if you don't want me to record you... You should just be inside working. I can't see you in there. Well, I don't know what you're going to do, man. I got to keep an eye on you, man. I'll be honest with you. I'm not going to do anything bad. I'm giving you that information. I'm just recording in broad daylight. Now, brother, if I was up in a tree hiding with night vision goggles or hiding in the bush, that would be suspicious. Well, come on, man. I guarantee it. The police are going to come, or sheriff, if they do come. They're not going to get my name. They're not going to get my ID. Nothing. And nothing wrong with you asking me questions, but at the point I decide not to answer, you should respect my rights too, don't you think? I don't think they're coming, my man. We got the walk of shame. We got the Hollister PD. I turned off the camera just for a split second, guys. We're gonna keep recording. Looks like they're gonna go educate him. You know, honestly, guys, I see a lot of videos where the police will come out. They'll tell the guy as long as he's on private property, he has a right, to, I mean, on public property, he has a right to be there. I mean, why even come out? Why waste resources? Why not just have the 911 dispatch educate them and say, hey, he's just a guy with a camera. That's what I would do. I told them they're going to educate them. They're not going to be able to get my ID. They're not going to be able to do anything. It is what it is, guys. Walk of shame, guys. Let's see what happens. Got vehicle 21. Looks like a sergeant. How's it going? Good, how are you? Good. So, you're not in any trouble. You're not I know. You're 
We're not being detained or anything like that. I know. Um, we're just going to ask that, uh, are you willing to give us your ID? Oh, no, I can't do that. I don't even carry it on me when I'm walking. Okay, that makes sense. Um, we're just going to tell you that you're not allowed to step foot onto the private property. I don't you know, need any not... directives, but I appreciate it. Pardon me? I don't need any directives, but I appreciate it. I, I don't break any laws. Okay. Well, we're just going to remind you that if you step foot on a private property, it could be considered trespassing. Could be or it will be. It will be considered okay. trespassing at this point. They do not want you on their property. If you return to the property and step foot onto the private property, you could be arrested for trespassing. Gotcha. Okay? That'll be up to them. Right now you're on public property. You're recording. It's well within your rights. You explained okay. that to him? Yes. Perfect. Appreciate you it. Talk to him about it. Appreciate it. Please don't impede the traffic of the vehicles moving. So I don't need any directions. I, I haven't done that once. Okay. Well, our understanding is that you were potentially on the property over there. So please. I was on there before originally. Okay. So please don't return to private property. Okay? Yeah. And, and just so you know, like I told the gentleman, just so you can have a little understanding, I wasn't trying to cause trouble there. When, when I walked up, there was no signs anywhere saying that like you know private or no trespassing or employees only so i walked around the side just doing i told him i'm just taking a little tour working on a story okay. when he finally asked me to leave i left peacefully and we appreciate that you know because he gave me the warning which is required you know and then at that no at that point if i would have stayed yeah it would have been trespassing but can I, do me a favor i was wondering could i get a business card from each one of you uh, and I'm fine with me i'm the supervisor on perfect. duty i'm sergeant leland okay? and your badge number please 114 perfect and can you also uh, write the incident number on here uh, on one of these and you guys, the body cam was on the whole time? Yep. Perfect. You guys did awesome. I appreciate you guys. I do have a question, though. I don't know if it'd be for you or the sergeant. I noticed over by Cabrillo, or the, not Cabrillo, sorry, the little uh, college, whatever it is downtown, a lot of times I see a police car, too, even, parked in the red zone there i think it's just more of a detour i don't know if you guys have like a little su substation inside there or not i was just curious though yeah but that's for emergency vehicle parking. that's what i thought well if, when it's an emergency but my, my suggestion would be just so to because you know you got to lead by example and this is just a suggestion i know it's not your personal say but maybe speak with the city manager or the mayor whoever's in charge of the or public works or whoever does the roads and maybe put a blue sign there police parking only because, you know, when you park in the red for non-emergency, even though I understand, yeah, you're a police emergency, and I get it 100%. You guys have to be ready to hit a call, be ready to bounce. Right. So I appreciate that. But just for the public's point of view, it would look nice if it said, you know, you just put up a simple sign or painted a blue, police parking only. That way. That's not a bad idea, man. So this is just my opinion, because I've noticed will, it a few times. I will 100% pass that along. Appreciate okay. it, my man. All right, dude. Have a good day. All right. Take care. Be safe. Always the goal. Oh, yeah. All right, guys. Thanks for checking out my latest audit over here in San Benito County, Hollister, California, at the new Amazon Fulfillment Center. I know I haven't been getting out there much, guys. I have a bad back. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video, though. I've been trying, guys. I've been trying. Just be patient. Make sure to pound that like button. Make sure to follow or subscribe. Show your support by sharing these videos and leave a comment. Let me know your thoughts. Pass or fail. You be the judge. And guys, if you like what you see, want to help get me on the road a little more often, help support the channel, there's going to be a link in the description. It's not necessary. You can help show support just by sharing these videos and leaving comments, but anything helps and I'll put it to good use. That being said, Hollister, California, Amazon Fulfillment Center. We'll see you on the next one. Thanks for watching. All right, guys, I'd like to do a quick shout out for my daughter's handmade natural soap company, Sea Heaton. Go check her out at www.seaheaton.com for the best handmade natural soaps in town, like peppermint, lavender, beachy, naked, and my personal favorite, cedar wood for men. Yeah, baby, use promo code AX1 and enjoy 10% off any $25 purchase or more. She's not only a phenomenal soap maker, she's a big supporter of the first auditing community. So let's show a little love, show a little support, go check her out, and tell her Anthony X sent you.